Welcome to Seltzer Mania 4! Ooh, yeah! Cream always rises to the top. And welcome back to a very, very, very special episode of Seltzer Sunday. Ladies and gentlemen, this is Seltzer Mania 4. Oh, yeah. And our long-standing heavyweight world title champion, Tugboat Vince Wozniak. Oh, yeah. Once again, with myself, just recently signed on with the team. I am Pat the Hitman Hart, and I'm really happy to be here on Seltzer Mania 4's live coverage of the event. Welcome, Hitman. Thank you, Tugboat. Been working on the other side of the... The country for a while but i'm here here for the final thing the final bout newsflash we're here to take on the current tag team champions and become the new seltzer tag team champions we're coming with fire vengeance and brimstone all of that win this episode we might win it all but first we're going to see which seltzer can be the new champion can they defeat the original the long-standing champion cherry lime chiller by fruit smash Ooh. We'll get into that in the first contender, though. We do have is this uh, Pink Lemonade by Noka. Pink Lemonade, Noka. And making its way up from the depths, the Tropical Pineapple by Topo Chico. Ooh. And last but not least, the Black Cherry from Buena Seltzer out of California. Oh, California way. Well, Tugboat, I think it's that time. Time for that first bout. And that Who's going to feel the steel and hold the gold? Let's find out. Live. Live. No script. No script. No nothing. No, nothing. No way, no how. You thought it was all fake? It is all real. This is the realest sport ever, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, yeah. Now, we're going to teach those Dudley boys what the real 3D is. Mm-hmm. Oh. Ah. Tugboat. Um, first, this being its first appearance Boozy in lemonade. Mania. Kind of like it, you know, it gets a little hot sometimes in the different bouts, different arenas. We're now, not tasting any carbonation. It's very smooth. No bubble guts. It's very flat, but it, in a good way. You, you, I think cold's going to be key in this. Uh, now, Hitman, what do you think of the taste? I mean, it's boozy, mm -hmm. but what does boozy mean? Does it mean there's no flavor at all? Or is it all alcohol? Oh, goodness gracious. If there is alcohol, I'm not really tasting it much. I'm not either. I think I like the good taste of that. Okay. I oh, nice. Seven, five. Seven, five for the taste. Okay. Now, like I said, there's no flavor. I'm not really getting any bubble gut. Not no way, no how. I mean, it's pretty flat, and I'm all right with that. I'm going to say a seven, two. You said what? Seven five. Seven five. Now the quantity. How many are we gonna have of the Project Pet? And what I mean by Project Pet, I mean Hitman Heart. Well, at this rate, one more taste. Everyone knows the rules. Everyone knows the rules. At this rate, that Dave Portnoy. At this rate, with how cold this is. I need to have at least 7.7 .7 to win the final bout. 7.7. 7. Oh, goodness gracious. So we've got 7.5 for the taste, 7.2 for the aftertaste, and the quantity we're going to have about 7.7. .7. It's going to give us a 7.4. Oh, Pat the Hitman heart. It's worth the purchase. Um, we're going to hit you right in those heartstrings. All right. Give it a try, people. It's pretty good. Or else, face the wrath. Face the wrath of Pat the Hitman Hart's elbow of doom. No one has gotten up from it. Not even Andre the Giant. He put that giant to sleep and he went night night without his sweet sweets. Shall we press on to the next one? Press on. Let's go. Are you ready, Pat the Hitman Hart? I'm ready as good as ever. Let's go. All right. Now, Tugboat, uh, it looks like you might have got a haircut recently. Yeah, I sure did. It's, you know, sometimes you got to let the mane grow and flow, and sometimes you just need to tame it every once in a while. And it was time to tame it. So what are we going to do now, 
Pat the Hitman Hart. All right, this is the uh, long-standing content contender, I believe the winner of Seltzer Mania 2. This is the Fruit Smash Super Hard Seltzer Cherry Lime Chill, ladies and gentlemen. Great googly moogie, the reigning champ has come to repeat And it itself. sure is a heavyweight, and by how I mean that, 160 calories. Ooh. 8% alcohol by volume. 8%? Great googly moogly, I haven't seen numbers like that since WrestleMania 10. The only thing that can beat this in a Seltzer's Ladders and Chairs match could be this Tropo Chico, this Noka, or this Buena Black Cherry. But We're we'll going to see. see. That Noka was a 7.4. Oh, yeah. Wait, I need to finish. <laughs> Sorry. You see a little bit of the coloring in here. Kind of matches the outfit, huh? Oh, yeah. There you go, yeah, there we man. Go. It also kind of shines bright with my belt. Oh, yeah. That's right. And we're going to get another belt. We're going to get the Tag Team Championships. Oh. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, man. It is spicy. I can feel it tingling from my lips all mm. the way down to my Ooh. tippy toes. Mm. Now, Hitman, how are you feeling about the taste? Mm. You know... It's 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 just missing something. Maybe it's just a little too much cherry, a little too much Ooh. of that alcohol. Maybe it's too strong for its own good. Oh man! I, 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 I'm gonna go with a six point eight. This time. Six point eight on the taste. Oh my gosh! Not off to a good start for the reigning mm -hmm. champ. Mm -hmm. You know, with the the aftertaste, you know it's it's tough following the uh, lemonade, the, yes. the no carbonation. I was really feeling the flatness mm -hmm. on that. You know, yep. I was liking it. So comparing it to this, it's okay. I'm just going to go with a 7.0. It's not really who and wowing me, hooting and hollering. Not really. I think it kind of razzled when it should have dazzled, unfortunately. Now, Quandy, what are we going to do? How are we feeling? What are we going to do when the Seltzer Boys come for you? Oh, you're not going to feel good. To we say that message to the Ops. Mm. It's still How cold. It's not cold. Too super filling. Mm. I'm going to go with a 7.2. 7.2. Okay, so we've got 6.8 on the taste. 7.0 in the aftertaste, and we've got 7.2 in the quantity. Unfortunately, it's not going to be a stronger score. It's just going to be a 7 on the dot, ladies and gentlemen. But it still passes. It is still worth the purchase. Taste it for yourselves, ladies and gentlemen, and let us know what you think. All right, shall we go on to the next one, brother? On to the next one, brother. Let's go. Oh, what do you say there, little Alfred? Hey. <laughs> All right, Hitman, it's time to do jokes. So once again, the fans of... All right, so what happens is the fans, they send us jokes, and it's our job to determine if they're weak or neat. So, uh, well, yeah, neat and, and weak. Okay, yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Watched a couple episodes. Yeah, that's never right. Filmed, never filmed one before. That's right. All right, so this first one is from Eli from Memphis, Tennessee. Oh, the Mid-South of the... It's wherever it's where it all started for WWE. Oh yeah, yeah. I think that's where Rattlesnake Johnson's from. That's right. Oh, that poor bastard. Jerry King, he, and Jerry the King Lawler. Yeah, he just he's never been around the snow and then he just got in a snowplow accident, the poor guy. But anyways, dear Seltzer boys, when does bread go bad? When you yeast expect it. <laughs> if you yeast expect it. <laughs> God. I, I, do you if you are if you're Jewish can you laugh at that joke? Uh, I don't know. Uh, well, uh, it's, it's not unle or, I don't know. We'll but, assume it's kosher. But, okay, okay. Uh, yeast expected. What do you think? Yeah, uh, week. week. Sorry, one week. Sorry, Eli. Next time. All right. This next one is from Roger from Abilene, Texas. All right. Dear Seltzer boys, what did one hat say to the other? You stay here, I'll go on ahead. <laughs> Where do they find these people? Uh, who writes these jokes? Well, I guess Roger from Abilene, Texas, yeah, Roger, dude. Roger. Well, what do you think? Oh, uh, two uh, weeks. Two weeks. Oh, we got a fortnight, ladies and gentlemen, for right. two weeks. All right, we got time for one more. One more. All right. This one is from Reed from Newport, Rhode Island. Dear Seltzer Boys, I hate speed bumps, but I slowly get over them. God. 
Well, dang. Is only, it only, the, only the Nidus can survive Seltzer Mania 4 tugboat, and neither of these did. Oh, we got three weeks! Oh, man. Well, for the first time in Seltzer history, I think we have three weeks. Or maybe, no, I think we've had a couple of them. Never mind. But anyways, continue to send the jokes, and the boys will determine if they're weak or neat. So let's continue with the show! The time for round three, Pat! I think it is. Oh, man! Pat the Hitman Art starting out round three! Here we It's Topo Chico Margarita. Ah! Pandemonium! Tropical. Ah! Let's go. This could be, could this be the contender? We already saw Cherry Lime Chiller dethroned by Noka, but will this next one be King of the Ring? We're the gonna clash find of the out. Ah, the Clash of the Castle. Stay tuned for Scotland on June, uh, something. Mid-June. Glasgow, Scotland. Clash of the Castle. Oi, Glasgow. All right. Now, Topo Chico has kind of been old reliable. It has been old reliable. Remember, ladies and gentlemen, this is the margarita style, so think a little bit limey. Maybe this pineapple will settle it out. Maybe you won't. Mm. It's actually not bad, but I think cold is key. Cold is key. I think it's got good music, good it's entrance. Got, I'm, not sure good music. I, I'm not sure it can wrestle. Uh, I think it does. It's got good music. Just needs a little pep in the step. That's right. You know, it's a it's a good looking it's a good looking can. It uh, you know it might it might look good, but it may not test may not learn good. You know, it could be, that's right. It could be the ultimate warrior of this this match right here. Oh yeah, you might need your mic too, I brother. Need my mic. Oh yeah. Oh, no, caught that. Ah! <laughs> okay, so what are we doing for the taste? I All think right. I need another one. I'm, I'm a little more bit distracted. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Me too. You threw me off of that joke, brother. Oh yeah. Okay, so uh, for the taste, the taste. How is it gonna? Mm. <sighs> Pineapple. Interesting flavor. Oh wow. You yeah. know. Ah. Seven, just barely, barely a little bit better than the cherry lime chiller. Is it because of the pineapple, or does the pineapple put it to the seven? Um, or does it bring it down to a seven? The pineapple brings it down to a seven. Oh, so if it was, if, what flavor do you think would make it better? Just a signature margarita. Ooh. So would you say that simple sells? Always. Get the message, ladies and gentlemen, and all you brands. Simple does sell. Okay, now for the aftertaste, it's really lingering, mm -hmm. man, and I'm not really feeling it too much. You know, when it lingers, I'm not a fan of that. Just go with the flow, and so I'm giving it a 5.9. Ooh. Sorry. No money in the bank for this one. Honest reviews only. Quantity. Bless you. Ah, oh, allergic to this bullshit ass. Aftertaste. <laughs> because of that aftertaste, six five. Six five. All right. And that's not even saying that the Pat the Hitman Heart would want to have six five. Oh man. So we've got seven zero oh on the taste, five nine for the aftertaste, and six five for the quantity, ladies and gentlemen. We're having a low score of a six four. Oh, I'm sorry, ladies and gentlemen. This one doesn't make the cut. Sorry, Topo Chico. This time, old reliable is not being reliable. That's right. Well, hopefully we got one more. One so more. So maybe one can, can... Right now, we've got the uh, Lemonade Boozy. It, or the Boozy Lemonade in That's the right, lead. by Noka. So stay tuned. One more flavor. It's Pandemonium. My payday Friday in Muskogee down Muskogee. here. Muskogee! Oh, right. the people ain't ready for this. It's time, Hitman Heart, let's go! All right, Tugboat and Pat the Hitman Heart, your challengers for the next world champion tag team of Seltzermania 4. No one is safe. Oh, we're coming for the gold. We're ready to feel the steel. We're ready to enjoy the alloy. Hide all your poutine and your chicken wings and beers, ladies and gentlemen. Yep, we're here to tickle that nickel. All right. This last, this is the Black Cherry by Buena. Buena. Live life, mas buena. Mmm, live mas buena. In a bottle.
Treat it as an imported bottle. So black, pop off only. Black cherry, not a bad, always a reliable. This is like your, your middle middle bout. I mean, they're always there. Always can give you about a good 15 minute match. Get the crowd working right for the main event. Mm -hmm. Could this be it? We'll see. Oh, it's going over the top ropes. Ooh. It's okay. It's all right. A little chalky. Yeah. Chalking it up. Um, I would argue to I would argue Hitman with Hitman myself and with Tugboat that this might be the worst tasting one actually. Uh, it, it, it's not chalking up the way I want. Mm -mm. No chalk up. I think like this chalk's not going to the green room as uh, uh, Vince Vitale would say. That's right. Uh, five nine for the taste. Five nine for the taste. Five nine for the taste, four five for the aftertaste. Mm -mm. I'm just gonna leave it there and it's lingering and I don't like it. I, don't like I it need a peppermint. That's right. Or maybe some more of that boozy lemonade. Don't recommend you drink too many of these, ladies and gentlemen. Read your read your books and go to school. Don't drink this. How many are we gonna have quantity wise? Three. Three. One, two, three, and it's out. Three. Once again, ladies and gentlemen, we got the low score. We got 5-9 for the taste. We got 4-5 for the aftertaste. And we got 3 for the quantity. That's going to be a low score of a 4.4. Sorry. It has progressively gone down. Unfortunately, that one's probably got to go to AEW. Oh, man. AEW is the calling your name, Black Cherry. But now it is... That time, ladies and gentlemen, it is outro time! Let's go! All right, ladies and gentlemen, thank you for joining us for Seltzer Mania 4. Oh, yeah! With our long standing champion, heavyweight champion of the world from parts unknown, Tugbo Vince. Ah! And I am Pat the Hitman Hart, happy to join this for my first time on Seltzer Mania 4. Ready to wild. take the tag it was team and then we took you to the top. We hope you feel, felt the steel. And we'll enjoy the alloy. Yeah. This Seltzer Mania 4 weekend. In and now. What? Oh. oh. And now. Oh. Tugboat. Oh, yes. And now it is that time of the show where we take part in something you probably already know. But for those of you who are first tuning in, what's going to happen is Pat the Hitman Hart and myself have taken all four flavors. And made something that we call the Suicide Seltzer. Now, to determine who's going to take this concoction, we're going to play a game of rock, paper, scissors. We're going to go one, two, three, and shoot. Then the loser has to take the Suicide Seltzer. So without further ado, let's do the thing. One, two, three, shoot. One, two, two three, three, shoot. shoot. Oh, bling, da, hi, oh. Pika fire. Oh, oh man. And he got him with the final, the, the, the tap out, huh? Yeah, I was By I was actually on like a, or I think yeah, I've been on a, a little losing streak. That's right. You made it up for uh, for Chef Boravi. Right. He should be happy. He should bring you back. <laughs> Anyways. Yeah, but thanks for tuning in. Be sure to like and subscribe. Tell your friends about the real Seltzer Sunday. Tune in for more of wrestling, WWE. If you see us out in the DFW area, say hello. Good afternoon, good evening, and good night. How was it? Tremendous. Thank you. Bye.